Hey, hey, hey! You can probably tell by the title of this video that we're doing another one of these, because that was actually really fun. So, today, we are doing, as you can tell by the title, what if Mario Hazonia actually wasn't a bust? Now, he said, like, what, it would be five seasons now? Yeah, it'd be five seasons now, and, uh, you know, watching his EuroLeague highlights, you know, back now that it's been, what, four years? Really, he was... He was just kind of just like a really athletic small forward. I don't really know what a lot of teams saw in him, but uh, I'm no NBA scout, but I, it definitely was just like, wow, this guy is a pretty athletic guy who can get to the rim. And uh, that was about all I saw. But then again, that was like a four minute highlight video from like four years ago. Maybe, maybe teams saw something in the workouts that I didn't. Anyways. The Magic took him 5th overall in the 2015 draft, and so far he's just been a pretty good rotational piece in the NBA. Definitely didn't live up to that 5th pick, but not in today's world. In today's world, he is an 87 overall, he's a two-way scoring machine, and he's on a minimum contract, and he's kind of discouraged. <laughs> and his contract out if the season ended today. There is no way I would resign with the Trailblazers. Well, Mario Hanzonia, it's interesting that you say if the season ended today is the season kind of ended like four months ago by now. So without further ado, let's get into it. Season number one, Team Giannis and Team LeBron, and Mario Hanzonia is the last pick in the All-Star Draft. Let's look at his numbers real quick. 19, 6, and 3. You know, his assist numbers aren't that good, but it's his career high. I figured I would make him, like, what I tried to edit his stats to be like is just kind of like a 25-5 and five guy. But uh, he's pretty good at, you know, stealing the ball. Shooting, uh, actually really efficient. I don't think he's ever shot these kind of, like, numbers before in his career. No, he hasn't. Well, wow. so this is a really efficient season for him so far. Luka Doncic is your MVP. John Morant's Rookie of the Year. Marcus Cousins, six man of the year. Guy with big hands, defensive player of the year. And then Brad Stevens is the coach of the year. Did Mario Henzonia make any all NBA teams? He did not. But uh, Pascal Siakam did. Good for him. Oh, wow. I guess with uh, Qui Gon, Pascal took his game to the next, next level. Is there anyone here that's kind of surprising? Oh, oh, oh. Nikola Vucevic, All-NBA second team? Um, well, that happened. And we're the sixth seed. And we're... Okay, bye-bye, Luka. I guess Mario Hezonia just kind of just... Wait, I gotta check his stats. What did he do? Oh, 25-5-3-3. Eh, three, three. Pretty efficient in game one. What about game two? I mean, yeah. he's He had a pretty okay series. Oh, and in game four, he, he re or actually this is game three, in game three, he really stepped it up, 33 and 11, and then 25, 5, and 3, 3, wait, what did he do in game one? Oh, I think I, okay, I was actually looking at game four, yeah, that's my bad, I wasn't paying attention, and we get beat out in five games by the Lakers, who go on to, yeah, they go on to win the NBA championship, LeBron James is your finals MVP. Here's a fun fact about Jose Calderon. He holds the uh, record for most assists in a career for the Toronto Raptors. He's like their leading assist guy. I don't... A sister doesn't sound right. Uh, I can't think of like what you would call that. But yeah, he holds that thing. Draft Lottery. I can't remember who, who all is in the... Oh, Lamella Ball's here. Evan Mobley. Or no, Evan Mobley's in 2021, I think. Oh, Obi Top. Yeah. Oh, James Wiseman, too. Anthony. Okay. It's coming back to me. So, yeah. The Magic, Jazz, and Memphis end up with 1-2. And let's check out the NBA comp. Can I talk? Let's check out the NBA Combine. All right, I guess this guy's like auto... Yeah, what... Oh, he has the highest vertical? That's pretty cool. And the highest bench? Oh, no. That's the Angelo... But wait. The Angelo's here, too? Um... Yeah, let's just go to the NBA draft and check the... Actually, we don't even have, like, a lottery pick, so why... You know what? We're gonna do it anyway. 
Yeah, Anthony Edwards goes to the Magic. Obi Toppin to the Jazz. Lamelo Ball to the Memphis Grizzlies. Cole Anthony to the Heat. James Wiseman to the New York Knicks. Hey, that's a pretty good pickup for the New York Knicks. Yeah, Jeremiah Robinson. Yeah, yeah I, I don't know why there's an apostrophe there. Maybe because Robinson hyphen just regular Earl isn't like allowed because of 2K's like weird thing that they do. Oh yeah, and we retain the rights to Alexei Dornev. I want to say he's Ukrainian. Yeah, see, look at me knowing my uh my names. Oh yeah, Mario Hazoni is a free agent. Please don't go to the Pelicans. I I'd rather you go to the Knicks than the Pelicans. Oh, and he hey. He, he, he's joining James Wiseman and RJ Barrett. He, he did the thing that I asked him to do. That's pretty cool. I'm kind of sad that uh, he didn't stick it out with the Trailblazers, you know. I, I pretty much say this like every video and uh, all the time. Oregon is a beautiful place. Insert a picture of Oregon here. Mario Hanzoni is now an 89 overall. We got Mitchell Robinson, Julius Randle, RJ Barrett, James Wiseman. Wait, is Mitchell Robinson gonna be? Is James Wiseman gonna be coming off the bat? I, I mean, I guess that makes sense. Let's. let's I feel like now that we have uh, Mario Hanzoni in the Knicks. Oh my lord, they went twelve and seventy last season. Yeah, they will definitely have a way better record than that. My God. Sorry for Knicks fans. I, I mean, I can't really like be sorry for you. I'm. I'm a Timberwolves fan, so like, I. You know, I can't really be talking. Anyways, season number two. Yeah, it's been like, what, 30 games and we already have a better record than we had last season? That's pretty impressive. Still not a starter yet, but maybe soon. Oh yeah, we also have Mitchell Robinson coming off the bench because we've got James Wiseman starting. He's actually, you know, he's putting up decent numbers. Yeah, he's putting up way better numbers than Mitchell Robinson. I'm actually going to look at his basketball reference after this because his stats are always like very unimpressive in 2K, but everybody like... Cause you gotta remember i haven't watched the nba in two years because i've you know been away from the whole thing but but like i hear everybody like talking about how good he is but his stats don't show in 2k now i know how good jonathan isaac is and how bad his stats are so maybe it's just 2k mario and hezonia did not even score a single point in the all-star game that's kind of disappointing well you know we were gonna make the playoffs Okay, so we beat Detroit and secured our spot for the playoffs. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Anthony Edwards is your rookie of the year. Uh, let's just change that real quick to make it... Nah, no, I'm kidding. Yeah, Dennis Schroeder, sixth man of the year. This happens quite often. Kristaps Przingis, he always wins most improved player of the second year, although he usually has way better numbers than this. Question is, did Mario Hizoni make an all-NBA team? He didn't. Martin Rosen's still here, though. Whoa, is that a career high? That is a career high by point two. Okay, that never happens. And we're the eighth seed going against Milwaukee, and we got swept. Unlucky. Yeah, but the Boston Celtics and the Rockets are in the finals, and yeah, uh, poor James Harden. Michael Mulder retired. Ooh, the Charlotte Hornets pick up Cade Cunningham. I guess they're looking to uh, fill the void that Kemba Walker left. Actually, actually, they did that with Terry Rozier, although, like, you know, that's probably not filling the void very well. Oh, yeah, Jalen Green goes to the Wizards. Mac McClung. I, is this an auto-generated guy? Or is this guy actually... No, he's from an actual college. Okay, I've never heard of this person. Jalen Johnson. DJ Boss. Yeah, so most of these players are, like, people I've heard of. Yeah, yeah, yeah Mobley. Oh, yeah. Uh, Josh Christopher, probably not, unless he went to an actual college. Uh, T went to an actual college. Probably not auto-generated. Greg Brown. <laughs> he made an appearance last video. Usman grew. Wait, why am I still here? We literally do not have a lottery pick. I actually want to see who we take 15th, though. Locker Maker. Thon's little brother, although Thon isn't dominating the league like he did last video. Oh, George went to the Heat, so... The Heat now have Bam Adebayo, Jimmy Butler, and Paul George. Yeah, that team's going to give uh, every team in the Eastern Conference a run for their money. Eh, nothing. Oh, never mind. Bam Adebayo went to the Jazz, so 
Yeah, never mind. They're not going to do what I thought they were going to do. Ah, uh, yes, all of those big name free agents and we pick up Markel Fultz. That's such a... That's such a Knicks-esque thing to do, you know? Instead of uh, putting players of Hezonia's caliber around him, they, they give him Markel Fultz. Hey, Mario... You know, we we know you wanted Paul George, but uh, Markel Fultz is the best we can do. Take it or leave it. Somehow we got worse. Oh, I just realized we might be tanking to get Mikey Williams or Imani Bates. Either one works. Oh, we didn't keep Mitchell Robinson, that's why. That is unfortunate. Oh, we did keep him. We just traded him for Terrence Ross. Another Knicks-esque thing, Stefan and Team Jonas. And Mario Hazoni is still not an all-star starter, but, I mean, he's still making them, so can't complain there. Mario Hazoni put up 15 points in the all-star game and was actually pretty efficient. That's something you never say about the all-star game. Stephen Curry is your season MVP. Kate Cunningham, Rookie of the Year. Hello there, Bull Bull. Anthony Davis. Uh, wait, Zion's the most improved? Wait, what? Wait, what? Oh. I I'm not going to question it. Hello there, Lloyd Pierce. Will we see, finally, Mario Hazonia on an All-NBA team? We will not. That is really unfortunate. Oh, yeah, and we missed the playoffs, of course. We, we literally, like, went 19. We, we almost had our... Our record was almost as bad as it was when, like, be like before Mario Hazonia came here. This seeded Lakers and the second seeded... Wait, who the Atlanta Hawks have? I mean, I guess they, like, became 90 overalls or something. Oh, yeah, and then the fifth seed, like, you're just a sweep them. Yeah. Anthony Davis is your finals MVP. Guy who's probably really upset about his face scan in 2K retired. Oh, I didn't even see what pick we ended up with. Oh, we fell. We fell to five. Oh, no. Disappointment. And, and we get Shakir O'Neal. Yeah, we tanked to get, you know, one of these three players, and we ended up with none of them. Pain. Hey, maybe we could, uh, you know, sign somebody here. And none of them sign. None of them. Azonia is now a 92 overall. James Wiseman and Markel Fultz are now an 82. Team Giannis and Team Stefan and Mario Hazoni is still coming off the bench. Oh yeah, we actually have a, well, it's not a winning record anymore. We just lost to the Pistons, but it was. Why is it after the All-Star break we always fall off? Oh yeah, this is the last year of Mario Hazoni's deal. Maybe he'll join an actual good team that can put players around him. All right. Jonas is your MVP once again. Monty Bates. Just, uh, 30 points? Almost, almost they're averaging 30 points in his rookie season. Yeah, that's... Wow. Oh yeah, Chris Paul, sixth man of the year. Oh, the other Antetokounmpo, most improved player. Brett Brown, coach of the year. Oh, James Wiseman made the All-NBA third team, but still no Mario has any... Oh. Oh. Um, maybe you should re-sign here if James Wiseman is doing this. Eh, still no playoffs. Pain. Joel Embiid finals MVP, your Sixers are the NBA champion. 
Wow, Chris Paul really won six million of the year and then said, yep, time to retire. And we land the 11th pick. Ah, uh, yes. Radoslav Drobniak, welcome to the team. Oh, this actually might not be a well. He was ranked number two and he fell to us at 11. Okay, maybe Mario should stay here. Or maybe this is a sign that sh he should leave since they're actually building a team. Hello, it's Van Boyza. That's definitely a Hungarian name. Yep, peace from Hungary. I, have we ever had like a Hungarian NBA player play in the league? I don't think we have. Yeah, welcome Derek Sims and yeah, this guy. First day of free agency, Mario Hazonia has no offers. And Mario Hazonia goes to the Rockets. Wait, is he joining James Harden? Oh no, James Harden is gone, but they have old man Russell Westbrook and then Justin Jackson and J oh, okay. Why couldn't you have just stayed with the Knicks? Good board. Oh wait, what? What? James Harden was literally not on the roster when I checked. Oh, they probably hadn't signed him yet. Ah, uh, that's my bad then. Oh, so, yeah. Yeah, you shouldn't have stayed on the Knicks. Ah, uh, yes, I love starting the season off 3-7. and seven. Team Giannis and Team Luka. And Mario Hazoni is still off the bench. I wonder if we will ever actually see him start in an All-Star game. Nick Washington Rookie of the Year. Lamella Ball, Sixth Man of the Year. Wait, who is he? Who is he backing up? Mike Conley's not there, and Mike Conley's old now. What? Who do they have? Anyways, Anthony Davis wins DPOI. Brandon Clark most improved. Sydney Lowe, hello there. Will we see Mario Hazonia on an All NBA team? No. No, we won't. And. Yeah, only in 2K can a team with James Harden, Russell Westbrook, and a good Mario Hazonia not make the playoffs. Pain. Oh, our like 13th pick went all the way to number one and we don't even have it because of Paul George trade. Yeah, we would have gotten Carl Paul, but uh, we, you know, the Paul George trade thing happened. The New York Knicks had a better record than us. Yeah, you probably should have stayed in New York. That's... My disappointment is immeasurable. My day is ruined. Giannis is your MVP for... What? What is this? Like the fourth time. Wow. Carl Paul, Rookie of the Year. He could have been on our team. Thanks, Paul George. Hello, Paul. What? This guy's scoring 28 off the bench. Like... Why are you allowing this to happen? Make him a starter, and maybe he'll win MVP. And then he didn't wait. Is Anthony Davis just gonna win the DPY every single year? Ah, uh, well, he he like missed 2023, but oh well, we we won't talk about it. James Wise, but wait, the Knicks couldn't even keep James Wiseman. He went to the Celtics. Okay, well, and he's. You know, 30, 10, and well, you, you see the numbers. You know how ridiculous this is. When Schneider coached the E, what? Why does he look so disgusted? And Mario, hey, Mario Hazoni is on the All NBA third team for the first time in his career. Let's go. He's there with the Lamelo Ball. Is literally like how many games did he start? He started zero games, and he's on the All NBA third team. Oh yeah, and we missed the playoffs, but you know who did the Knicks without James Wiseman? And it's, the Celtics aren't here, so James Wiseman didn't even make- wait. What? Ah uh, yes, Atlanta's in the finals again. This time they're going up against a J- wait. Who do they have again? Mitchell- oh yeah, wait, Jason Tatum came here too? What? They have Adebayo, Mitchell, Jason Tatum, and then Dennis Schroeder. Yeah, this team's winning. Atlanta doesn't have a chance. Yeah, well actually, it went to seven games and Dennis Schroeder is your finals MVP, huh? Uh, I'm not gonna question it. Guy named after an instrument retired. And with the fourth pick, we draft a 5'9 point guard named Brevin. He's 25 years old. I don't know if this can get any more disappointing.
Yeah, Mario Hazoni is now the highest overall player on the Rockets. Russell Westbrook is, uh, wow. Uh, Trey Burke is almost, uh, as high overall as Russell Westbrook at this point. Wow. Good news is, though, Mario Hazoni only has two years left on his deal. Ah, my 2K crashed. That's amazing. Team Giannis and Team Luca, and there we go. Mario Hazoni is now what the eighth pick i think this is the highest pick he's ever been in the all-star draft does that mean that he might be a starter soon we'll have to find out oh yeah Mario Hazoni led his team in points in the all-star game with 19. oh yeah it took me looking at the mvp voting to figure out who lamello ball was the backup to yeah that makes sense what doesn't make sense is why the memphis grizzlies would draft lamello ball when they have john moran they could have had james wiseman Jeez, imagine that duo, James Wiseman and John Morant. Luka with another MVP, I don't know what this is, like how many this is at this point. Guy named Tugay won Rookie of the Year. Mellow Ball, six man, wait, are you telling me this guy was like, what, fourth in MVP voting and he still is like off the bench? Good lord. Oh, BJ Boston most improved, I didn't see this coming. Otis Newman, hello there. Hey, Mario Hazonia is once again on the All NBA third team. He's moving up in the world. He's made the playoffs. He's, nope. And neither did we because, uh, you know, we're the Rockets and James Harden and Russell Westbrook are really old. Oh, yeah, and Memphis got first rounded by. Hey, the Mem Wait, who do we have on our. Huh? Oh, Cassius Stanley and. I mean, hey, this is a pretty good team. Wait, we got an old man, Paul Joe. Okay. Yeah, eight seed Minnesota about to tear it up. Eh, as soon as I say that, disappointment. Oh yeah, and the Denver Nuggets are about to win the championship. Never mind, the Hawks just came back, and Trey Young is your Finals MVP. Sorry, Jokic, not this year. Guy who used to be one of my favorite players retired. Ah yes, and we take Franklin Burke number six. Is this a good draft pick? Um. Who okay, who is available? Let's 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 inspect Mr. Lewis Ramsey. What was his big board ranking? No. No. It, no. This was a terrible pick. God, I cannot wait till Mario Hazoni is a free agent again. Ah uh, yes, we saw Jalen Jones and OJ Copeland and wait wait, are these the rookies who drafted? No, they're undrafted in second round. Oh, I'm not gonna question it. Mario Hazoni is officially regressing, okay. Listen to me, Mario. Now is the time where you chase the chip. You're getting old. You are 31. You're you could be a first. Well, you could be in the Hall of Fame, but all you have to do is chase the chip. You just have to go to a winning team. You have to make a deep playoff run. Are you listening? Please make this video interesting. You love to see it. I'm not against returning to the Rockets at all, but I'm going to see what I'm worth in free. You're not against returning to the Rockets? What's wrong with you? What about the... Like, what What about, like, Houston in general is, is worth, like... Worth, like, wasting the prime years of your career? Well, actually, he's kind of past his prime now, but that's besides the point. Team Giannis and Team Luka. Uh, oh, I... Thought Mario Hazoni missed the All Star game, but he didn't. He's still here. He's now the second. Uh, well, not the second, but what would this be? The the seventh pick in the All Star draft. Well, at least for this team, he was the seventh pick. Yeah, that probably means in you know in another year or so he's gonna be a starter eventually. Honest with his sixth MVP at this point. No, five. Farewell, rookie of the year, Lamelo Ball. Lamelo Ball is still not starting. This is a travesty. Monty Williams, hello there. Oh yeah, Zion and James Wiseman. Are, wait, James Wiseman has been on the All NBA first team at this point, right? Yeah. What about Zion? Nope, his first time. Okay, good. I wasn't tripping then. What about Mario? Okay, yeah. No, Mario's not here, unfortunately. And he's not in the playoffs either because, you know, he plays for the Rockets. Chicago Bulls led by Imani Bates won the championship. He's your finals MVP. Bryce Ferguson retired. Ah, uh, yes, the Rockets still don't have their pick. Wait, how did the Memphis Grizzlies get the number one pick if they have John Morant and LaMelo Ball? What, what, what? 
Wait, are you telling me the Memphis Grizzlies have LaMelo Ball and John Morant still can't make the playoffs? Yeah, there's a lot of players that are free agents. Uh, does Mario has only- Oh, he has 10 offers. Uh, his leading offers, the Cavaliers. Oh no, that can't be good. I mean, they have Cole and actually, you know, this might not be terrible if he goes to the Cavaliers. They do have Cole Anthony. Oh, now his leading offer is a set. Wow, he really can't stay away from James Wiseman, huh? Yeah. Please, uh, please join James Wiseman. Win championships together. The attempt number two. Come on, let's run it back, dude. No, 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 no. You don't want to go to the Rockets. You, you would definitely want to go to the Cavs more than you would the Rockets, believe me. There, there's nothing for you in Houston. You have more opportunities in Cleveland than you do in Houston. Just let that sink in. Mario, listen to me. Are you listening to me, Mario? You, you gotta go to the Celtics or the Cavaliers, come on. Yes, Mario! Yes! Attempt number two with James Wiseman, let's get it. Boy, am I glad to be out of here. Yeah, I'm not gonna miss you at all. Happiness noises. Mario Hazoni is still regressing, but uh, at least he has people around him now. You know, Malcolm Brogdon, James Wiseman. They won more games than the Rockets, which I mean, that's not hard to do, but they almost made the playoffs, so things are looking up for Mario Hazonia. Team Giannis and Team Luka. Mario Hazonia, nine time All Star. I don't think he'll ever be a starter, but it's okay because he's got more All Stars than, you know, most of the people that are actually starting, so. I just want to make the playoffs, man. Come on. Come on. <laughs> Look, as your MVP. Uh, guy from Sweden, rookie. Wait, you mean you're a 21 year old? Yeah, I, I, I ain't a question it. Hello there, Devontae Graham. Hello there, Manny. Hello there, Monty. Okay. Did he make. No, no, all the NBA teams. What about. Okay, James wasn't get demoted to the second team, but that's alright because I. We, we missed the playoffs. I. Uh, I can't have nice things in this simulation. Pain. It is July 18th and there is still fireworks going off in my neighborhood. I hate people. The god himself, Thawnmaker, retired. Except he's not so godly in this, uh, sim. But, I mean, he managed to get picked up by some teams before his career ended. He last played in Toronto. Maybe he can have a successful EuroLeague career and make the Hall of Fame because, uh, you know, he dominated the EuroLeague, like, uh, who's that one player that made it? Arvidas Sabonis. But the thing is, that guy was actually a pretty good NBA player. He, you know, he just had to wait 10 years to actually get there because, you know, the whole Soviet Union thing. Oh, hey, the Minnesota Temple. Wait, how did the... Wait, who do they have now? I thought they had, like, a really good team. If, if this team is losing enough games to get the number one pick, then, like, my Boston Celtics team has no shot. Well, it's actually Mario... Well, it's not even Mario. It's actually James Wiseman's Celtics team. It, like, yeah. English. Hey, hey, hey. If, I, if I'm the Celtics GM, I, I'm, I'm trading Malcolm Brogdon and Dylan Brooks and trying to get a third star. Since, you know, Malcolm Brogdon isn't that anymore. Team Giannis and Team Luka. Uh, oh, yeah. I, I just... Once again... Thought Mario Hazonia did not make the all-star team, but uh, my eyes just deceived me. Yeah, he now has as many all-stars as... Wait, who has 10 all-stars? I want to say that Ewing has 10 or 11, so he has just as many or he's one off of Ewing. Oh, I'm pretty sure they took my advice because instead of Malcolm Brogdon, we have now have Darius Gardland. Oh, we also got Julius Randle from Minnesota. Still have Dylan Brooks, though. Oh, we traded Malcolm Brogdon for Julius Reno. I don't know how I feel about that. Oh, we just, wait, we just picked up Darius Garland on a one, on, on a minimum. Di wait, wait, whoa, 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 what? I, I'm not gonna question it at this point. Giannis with the six MVP. Now last name Burr, but instead of an I, it's a Y. One rookie of the year. Wait, is he? Oh, okay, he's a center. A little ball, six man of the year, still backing up uh, General Morant. Ah, uh, yes, Robert Forbes, most improved player. Mike Budenholz, or coach of the year. James Wiseman, first team on NBA, that's a pretty good sign. Yeah, no no Mario Hazonia, big sad times. Oh, hey, but we're the fifth seed. And can we... Oh, no, we're down 2-1 against Miami. Wait, 
Miami have on their team? Ah, yes, Isaiah Whitehead. And, oh, Kuminga. Josh Christopher. Uh, okay, so it's not a bad team. They also have Miles Turner. So yeah, it's not a bad team. Pretty close game here. We're pulling away just a little bit. Oh yeah, we're gonna win. Yep, we won. Uh, what game would this be? Oh yeah, this would be Grand Five. And we're ahead. Uh, not for long. But actually, we're whoa, we're really ahead now. Wait, what? Okay. Yep. Uh, yep. Wait, where can I see or like what we scored in like the individual quarters? I don't guess I can see that from this menu. That's unlucky. Yeah, game six. We could take the series here. And I mean we're hey, we're pulling away really I don't know what I was gonna say there. Oh yeah, we won. And we move on to the second round. Now we have to play Giannis. I am scared. Eh yeah. Uh, I'm oh can we beat Giannis? Come on, James Wiseman. Do your James Wiseman thing. Yes. Yes. We take game one. Alright, game two. Let's get it. I'm ready. Oh, we're ahead. We're ahead here, too. What is going on? Is, is Giannis this old? I, I, I gotta see. I gotta see what's going on. Oh, he's 34. Okay, yeah, Giannis is that old. Yeah, we win game two as well. I'm pre yeah. Now we're playing on our home court, and don't tell me that we're gonna lose two games on our home court, please. Uh, it's really close. I'm jumping in. I've gotta see what. I gotta see this. Oh uh, yes, Mario. Is, oh wait, I'm controlling Mario Hazoni at the free throw line. Oh god, this camera angle. It's so ugly. Jesus. Oh, Mario Hazoni has 20 points. He's seven for 13 on shooting. Okay, your free throw routine is like super long. Hey, can you shoot that? Okay, and he greens it. Wow, he can literally give us a two point lead here. He just has to make the second free throw. Oh yeah, De'Aaron Fox and Kyle Kuzma play for the Bucks now. Wait, you mean to tell me that Giannis is teaming with De'Aaron Fox and Kyle Kuzma and they're still the first seed? I mean, De'Aaron Fox is pretty good, but Kyle, Kyle Kuzma kind of fell off. I don't know. 2K Sims are really weird. Can I not like skip? Do I really have to be controlling a team that? Okay, never mind. It's X. I, I don't know how controllers work, man. I'm, I'm a PC player that you know buys 2K. Oh, Giannis with the ball. Giannis guarded by James Wiseman, and James Wiseman fails him. Oh no, Giannis can tie the ball game here. I don't know how good of a free throw shooter he is in 2K. Okay, he drains both of them. He's a decent free throw shooter in 2k. That's oh Please, 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 please just win this. Please James Wiseman. Just just do it James. Oh wait, we have Kevin Love Wait, Kevin Love has to be like 40 by now. What? Uh, yeah, he's he's actually 40 um, I, I don't guess like he regresses at all Passes to Hazonia. Hazonia behind the three-point line. He drives up to half court. He's gonna hold the ball for. He's just gonna milk the clock for a little bit. Fourteen seconds. Twelve seconds. Eleven seconds. Ten. Nine. And you just do something. Okay. He drains in for a little bit. It was five seconds. What are you doing? Oh no way. What am I watching? Hazonia. And it's gonna be overtime, isn't it? Unless Marcus Smart hits that. Marcus Smart hits that! What? I I I I I can't believe what I just witnessed. Please tell me that counts. Please, please tell me that counts. Um, is that the call overturned? What? No. What? I'm gonna see that for myself. I'm gonna see it for myself. Come on. Come on. Please. Oh, wait. I'm really out no, here. Come on. Come on. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that was way late. I just got hyped up for nothing. Oh, no. Disappointment. Uh, I'm gonna sink cast a little bit over time. We're gonna go a little bit slow, though. Oh, we're ahead for a little bit. Yep, it's looking like we're gonna win in overtime. Never mind. The Bucks take the lead. Okay, I'm jumping in. I guess what's going on. Oh, they also have Vucevic. This Bucks team's actually pretty good. 
really old boost pitch though. Aaron Fox really almost lost the ball. Garland picked his pocket. He, yep, he just lost Darius Garland. Uh, can he? Okay. Kevin Love plays some pretty good defense. Passes him smart. Pazonia's got an open lane and Pazonia just dunks over whoever that was. I want to say that was Vucevic. Yeah, Vucevic just loses it. See, this these were the kind of highlights I was seeing in his Euro League highlights. If it, I might like link them in the description if I can find the video that I watched. Yeah, look at that. Hmm. Slow motion, just. Mm. Okay, I'm done. Aaron Fox bringing up the ball up the court. Uh, 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 uh. I don't know what I'm like saying. Oh yeah, he's gonna drive into the lane. He's gonna pass it up to Vucevic. Yeah, why is Darius Garland guarding Vucevic? You know what? I'm I'm not even gonna ask. Mario Hazonia, can you can you make like a clutch play here? Come on, Kevin Love, can you set a screen? Oh my lord, there's three people on Mario Hazonia, and he just dream he greens a three with like three people in front of him. Hello. Uh, one, two. Okay, it's just it's kind of just one, but. Kind of two. Anyways, Mario has only just drained a three. And we take game three. We've actually got a minute left, so that's a lot of time. Kevin Love guarding Giannis Antetokounmpo. It's, it feels so weird seeing Kevin Love in a like, Celtics jersey, but it kind of makes sense. Yeah, Giannis just put Mario on a poster. Wow, um, that's kind of embarrassing. Hey, ref, can you hurry? Yeah, okay. Hurry up and shoot your free throws. I don't have all day. Inbound the ball. Okay, there we go. I don't know why, but it, it, it takes... This it's is, like, taking forever. Mario Hazoni with the ball. James Wiseman sets a screen. That didn't give him any coverage, but... Oh, Mario Hazoni just gives him a... Wow, what a pass. Just... Finds an opening, Vucevic is just lost, man. He's lost in the sauce and James instead of Fox's time. 17 seconds left on the shot clock. Willis Randall's playing so wait, I thought we had Kevin Love guard out oh, you know oh wow, he's gonna hit that. Oh, never mind, that guy sucks. I don't even know who that was. It looked like an auto-generated player. I don't think he had an actual face scan. Julius Randall! What? Alley oops it to James Wiseman. What the hell? I thought he was just throwing the ball off, like out of bounds, so just to like, what? What, <laughs> what is this? It looks like he just put the base. <laughs> I don't know why, but this looks so weird. He just put the ball over Giannis's head and then alley ooped it to James Wiseman. Wow, what a play! Yeah, the Bucks are just getting like styled on right now. Pass it into De'Aaron Fox. He's gonna get. Well, he had an open lane. He still has an open lane, and they still can't guard him. But he misses the shot. That's pretty embarrassing. They're gonna foul Mario Hazonia. You're gonna easily drain both of these free throws, right? Because that's just the type of player Mario is. That is just the type of player Mario is, and he's gonna hit both of them, isn't he? Yeah, that's what I like to see. Yeah, I mean, this game's over. I'm just gonna simcast the rest of it. Yep. And that is game three in the books. A whole 12 VC from this. Yeah, we're 3 0 on Giannis and company. And we close it out here. And it looks like we are. Yep, we're gonna close it out here. We're gonna never mind. Never mind. They're gonna wow. They really just did that. Huh. I guess it's never over till it's over, huh? Oh, please don't come back from a 3-0 lead. That's never happened before in NBA. Okay. Yep. It's never happened before in NBA history, but it's happened in the MLB, I know that. Oh, and we go up against six seeded Cleveland to almost wait, who did who did they get instead of Mario Hazonia? Ah, uh, Jaron Jackson Jr. This could be interesting. It's in the game one. Please don't tell me that Cleveland's gonna give us a harder time than number one seeded Milwaukee. Yeah, we lose game one. Game two, it's looking pretty good. It's still really close. And we're gonna take game two, just barely. Game three now. Up ahead early and pretty close. Cleveland's kind of pulling away though. Cleveland will pull away. Game four. Can we tie up the series? No, it looks like Cleveland is going to take a 3 1 lead. And this is not looking very good. This is really not looking good. This is, yep. Yeah. 
Cleveland make the NBA Finals against the Warriors. Where have I seen this before? And the Jalen Brown led Warriors win the NBA Championship. My disappointment is immeasurable. My day is ruined. Kevin Love retired. Good riddance. Kind of heated that we lost, but oh well. We are here. Actually, everybody's regressing, so we might actually have a tougher time now. Oh yeah, and we don't have Darius Garland anymore. Team looking Team Giannis once again, and oh wow, Mario Hazonia has officially missed the All Star game. James Wiseman's still here though; he's still starting. We are also probably not gonna play off, so uh, big disappointment. Yeah, the Knicks are the first seed. Wait, they don't have James Wiseman and they don't have... Who, who could possibly be on the Knicks? Ah, yes, Jerry Allen and Bull Bull and, and Kobe White. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. This, this league makes no sense. Oh, we're actually going to make the playoffs, just barely. A guy named Dirk who is not Nowitzki, Rookie of the Year. My little ball, six man of the year for like the eighth time. Uh, just kidding, it's only been six. Wow. Jonas, DPO1. Hayward, but it's not Gordon. Henry Miller, hello. Yeah, if he if he missed the All-Star, he's definitely not making it all in the 18. Oh, but James Wiseman's still here. And we're the seventh seed going up against Milwaukee again. And we can't beat them two years in a row. Never mind, we just come back from a 3-1 deficit. Okay, time to simcast. Come on. Come on, seventh seed of Boston. You can beat Brooklyn. They probably don't have anyone like... Yeah, Katie and Kyrie have retired at this point, but we lose game one. Mario Hazonia tried. No, they have Chit, Holmgren, and Rui Hachimura. I mean, it's closer than it was last game, and it looks like we're going to take game two. We do. Game three. It's pretty close. We're pulling away just a little bit. We're going to win game three, game four. And, yeah, we're probably not going to win. Four. Never mind. They just, yeah, they just threw. We now have a 3-1 lead against the Brooklyn Nets to go to the Eastern Conference Finals as the 7th seed. And it looks like we're going to beat the Brooklyn Nets. Wow. Please tell me we go up against New York. No, we go up against Cleveland. Okay. I figure we can beat New York because they didn't have anyone very impressive, but the Cavaliers have Tyler Hero now. Oh, this is going to get interesting. Game 1. It's act We actually are leading by a little bit, but... Now we're leading again. Come on, close it out, close it out. Game one goes to us. You know what, I'm just gonna simulate the round and see what happens. Eh, hey, yep, and we get eliminated. That's kind of predictable. Well, the Kings led by Cade Cunningham. The A Championship. Bonnie Bates is your MVP. Guy named Frankie. Hello Ball, six man of the year. This guy, uh, I'm not even gonna try and pronounce that. Yeah, me. Yeah, no way I'm trying to pronounce that. Yeah, he's your most improved player of the year. Guy that looks like the dad from Incredibles when he's coach of the year. James Wiseman, all NBA first team. Of course, there's no Mario Hazonia. He's old at this point, and we didn't make the playoffs either. Disappointment. The Kings go back to back this time. Cats, your MVP. Or finals MVP, I should say. Mario Hazoni is now on the Wizards, I think. I think that's who that was. Yeah, he's backing up Kelly Oubre, and he's here with Darius Garland. Well, attempt number two of James Wiseman didn't work out, but uh, maybe we can end on a high note by winning a championship in Washington. Well, James Wiseman is MVP. And Pavin, rookie of the year, Alan Crawford, six man. Wait, the Celtics had the MVP and the six man of the year? Steven Enoch, wait, how many appearances is this guy going to make? This was like the reincarnation of Ben Wallace last video, right? Roger Jacobs, most improved, Henry, Henry Miller, hello again. And yeah, Washington didn't make the playoffs. Mario Hazonia is not even on a team. Mario Hazonia is now backing up Luis Ramsey in uh, Dallas. Yeah, we missed the playoffs. Trey Young's your MVP. What? Okay, Trey Young's doing his uh, best Michael Jordan impression. Oh, Ken Baster. What is this, Rookie of the Year? Become Manion Six Man. Here's Steven Enoch, DPOI. 
Evan Holland, most improved. Henry Miller, hello. And we missed the playoffs once again. I mean, it isn't even pain at this point. At this point, it's agony. Agony. Kings win their third. Akira O'Neal is your finals MVP. Wait, is that the guy that the Knicks drafted? Yeah, it is. Mario Hazonia has decided to return where it all started. Well, where it all started in this video. He's back in Portland. James Wiseman back-to-back -back MVPs on different team. What? Yeah, so he... Oh, it's not back-to-back. -back. Never mind, he doesn't join Moses Malone. That's unfortunate. Alvin Cole's both rookie of the year and sixth man of the year in the same year. That's never happened before in the NBA, but I think it's happened twice in an actual video. Also, I need to slow down. I'm talking pretty fast. Obi Toppin's your defensive player of the year. Corey Sessions most improved. I know how to say this guy's name, but I forgot. Yeah, he's coach of the year. My bad. We missed the playoffs. That's predictable, but still very unfortunate. Is it beyond agony at this point? Nah, I think it's still agony. Kings have won their fourth. Alex Antetokounmpo is your MVP. Or finals MVP. Why do I keep saying MVP for the finals MVP? It's, it's the finals MVP. Oh, no. That is going to do it. Mario Hazoni retires where it all started. I, I guess it kind of all started when he uh, actually got good at the whole basketball thing. So, yeah. Very, very unfortunate. Alright, time for the to look at the team record. Mario is 5th in 3-pointers in a season with 10. He's also 11th which puts him at 5th and 3rd. Right for 3rd and 3-pointers with 10. Now for the NBA record, 43rd in career points with 27,055. 16th in 3-pointers made in his career with 3,982. And lastly, the award history. Ari Hazoni was a 10-time All-Star and a 2-time 3rd All-NBA team. He made the Eastern Conference Finals twice and the Eastern Conference Semifinals once. He never won a ring. For his career, he averaged 18 points, 5 rebounds, and 3 assists on 1.5 steals per game on 47% field goal percentage, 41% from 3, and 88% for the line for his career. Now, will he make the Hall of Fame? And he will He'll make the Hall of Fame alongside Pascal Siakam. And he will not have his jersey retired by any of the teams that he played for. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that is going to do it for me. I hope you all enjoyed, and I will catch you guys in the next one. It's not for me to say